Maldives, baby. Welcome to the second and last part of our honeymoon series from the Maldives. We stayed at the Luxor Resort in the South Ari Atoll and it was nothing short of a dream. The resort is spread across a 4 km stretch of sandy beaches and world class amenities. In our previous video, we gave you a tour of a spacious and gorgeous overwater villa on this side of the island. This video will show you all the amenities, activities and meals we enjoyed in the next two days. Let's go! Good morning from day 2 in Maldives. We had a rush start to our day because we woke up around 9 am and we had to make it for breakfast before 10 30. There are two options here on this resort for breakfast buffet. We have Mix and the East Market. So today we decided to hit the East Market. The East Market had a variety of options and it was overwhelming to say the least. There was the standard continental stuff with like croissants, waffles, fruit juices. But what it's really known for is the Asian section where there's so many stations such as the dumplings, the live wok station, an omelette station to make your own noodles and fried rice. There was also a section where there were fruits and milkshakes and you could order whatever beverage you want while you're seated. So overall, like a lot of options and a great way to start the day. Our breakfast was included in the reservation we had made and that's for all the days we are over here. So what's the plan for the afternoon? The plan for now is to go paddle boarding for me and Sakesh is gonna go kayaking. Bye, Sakesh. <laughs> So I was in a single person kayak and Chai was in a stand-up paddle board but when we looked at the sand bank at a distance from us uh, we wanted to come check that out so we jumped in a double person kayak and came right here and it's pretty cool you have blue waters all around even the romantic water villas are right in front of you and we're just gonna keep walking until we explore more of this small sand bank out here okay so Sankish is taking his first dip in the water. Ah, so this is love. This is love. <laughs> okay, tropical vacation over any mountain or city. This is amazing. Time to head back and grab some lunch. And now we are at the Bailey Bar to grab some late lunch mm -hmm. after all that fun in the lagoon side of the island. And uh, the plan for the afternoon is just to relax and eat and swim. Yeah. <laughs> that was so good. Swimming in the pool definitely feels much more fresher than in the salt water. Uh, so, I think it's a perfect sequence. 
swim out there in the ocean and then it washes it all off in the pool. <laughs> How has your day been so far? Uh, it's been fun and relaxing at the same time. <laughs> I think I would call this day to be the pool day. <laughs> yeah. Where we both have just been chilling in the pool and by the pool all day. Amazing sunset from the infinity pool at Celsius. We went back to our room to freshen up, and we are now here at the second a la carte restaurant, Allegria. They have some great Italian options, so let's see what they have in store for us. Okay. Our dinner and we opted for the two vegetarian options. One was the minestone soup, and the other one was the vegetarian lasagna. The vegetarian lasagna was so so, but the soup really surprised us. Definitely give that a try. Biscuit, a homemade cantuccini. You can have it with morning tea or coffee. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you so much. Hello, Thank you. Good night. It's time to head back and call it a night, and here comes our ride. Good evening. Good morning from day 3 of our trip here in Maldives. We woke up just in time to enjoy this mesmerizing sunrise in front of us. We can watch the sunrise straight on from here from the deck and I just don't want to get up. It's, it's absolutely breathtaking. Cooking off with fruits, what are we getting? Oh, actually this is the juice station, so we are gonna go for a watermelon ginger juice and a mixed juice. So for breakfast, we've come to The Mix, which is an international buffet section here for breakfast as well as dinner. I'm kicking it off with some watermelon and ginger juice, but since we are going snorkeling right after this, to help me with my motion sickness, and some dosa and sambar. Since we're now headed to the most awaited adventure of this trip. If I need anything, you can just let us know. Thank you. Thank you. 
So what did we do so far? We took a trial jump into the water and saw a gigantic mango. And now we are back on the hunt for our fish. So the snorkel tour that we've chosen to go on is a combination of turtle and whale shark. Whale sharks is what this area is famous for and that's what brought us to Lux. Uh, but unfortunately it's been a while and we've been looking for a pod or a place where they are hanging out but no luck so far so fingers crossed in the next hour or so we can find them. How was your two minutes with the target? Underwhelming. Very underwhelming for the amount of money we paid. <laughs> back from the tour and it was definitely one of the most disappointing ones because we unfortunately could not get to see the whale sharks. We did take a stop to see the turtles, even that was hardly for two minutes. I wish we got some more time to just check out the beautiful reef and the marine life down there. We got back from the tour around 1 pm and used the resort's courtesy room to rinse off the salt water and just freshen up. From there, we directly came to the Lagoon Bar to grab some lunch. We are having the quinoa salad and the vegetable panini and both of them are yum. They have two such phone booths on this property using which you can call anywhere in the world. So you now don't have an excuse to not call your mom. Okay, let's go. afternoon it wasn't that hot so we decided to rent some bike to ride across the island. We are now headed to our room but before that we are taking some stops at some of the notable places and this is our first stop at the Tree of Wishes. You're at the Tree of Wishes, the guests staying on the property right down a wish and hang it on the tree with the hope of it coming true. I wish all of them come true. So there are these bike racks available at almost all the spots on the island. So you can just drop them off, get to your business, enjoy, do whatever you want to do and then come back, pick them up and head to your next stop. We are just going to check out the fitness center to see if we want to make some time and take a stop here for some workout. So let's see how it looks from inside.
Oh my god, the water is so clear. I can't believe tonight is the last night in Maldives. Uh, I knew I would say this, but I really wish we were here for much longer. Yeah. But that's reason to come back again. The waters are so pristine. <laughs> Everything's like heaven out here. Surprise, surprise! <laughs> Happy honeymoon! <laughs> We spent the rest of the afternoon and pretty much all of the evening here in our water villa because we didn't get a chance to do that at all. It was a great surprise to see a bath being drawn. Chai made the most of it and enjoyed that bath thoroughly. I did. And she did. And it's now time for us to go for our last reservation, dining reservation here. And we are going to Census. now at census for our dinner and since it's our last evening we decided to celebrate with a round of drinks i have ordered the tea of gods and sakesh has ordered the land of spice cheers Good morning from our last day in Maldives. I'm so bummed that we have to check out from this beautiful water villa. I will definitely miss waking up to the sound of the water every morning. And the view of the horizon, the fishes down there, all of it. This, yeah. I'm gonna miss this paradise. Well, never mind. There are more amazing trips ahead of us. So for now, let's check out and grab some delicious breakfast again at the East Market. So if I had to pick between Mix and East Market, I would definitely go for East Market. That's what we did two times out of the three breakfasts we had because there was a variety of options and they have individual stations for Asian items. So if you want to mix it up, I think that's the best place to go. And with that, I think uh, we are about to end our trip here. Uh, we've been called for the seaplane ride and she uh -huh. just got back from settling everything else uh, at the reception. So I think we're going to miss this place. Uh, we'll take you all the way till the mall airport so let's go before we miss our flight but before that we definitely wanted to do one thing before we headed out which was write our wishes on the ribbons for it to be hung up on the tree of wishes if you remember seeing that from yesterday's videos you would have seen there were so many wishes up there and fingers crossed ours come true too <laughs> With those memories of a lifetime, it's time to head back home. We are so glad we managed to stay at this resort for free. To know how exactly we did that, check out the previous video on the step-by-step -step breakdown. If you are new here, subscribe to our channel for more destination recommendations and give this video a thumbs up. Until next time, keep exploring!